three guesses where we are right now. If you guess Wilderness Lodge, you guess correctly. <laughs> I want Chewy to try the brisket and cheese menu item at Geyser Point. So we thought tonight would be a, a, good, day a good day to do it, exactly. I made it over 11,000 steps so far today. Good job. Good job. But yet it says I've walked less miles. No, no, you're, yeah, we agreed that it was, yeah, it was wrong. So I'm, I'm hovering just below five miles. So we got a little surprise for me <laughs> while we were at Disney Springs. We'll show y'all later. Thank you, Chewy. You're welcome, my princess. I hate these long, gradual hills. They hurt my back. Isn't that pretty? It's a pretty gate. Use the force, Luke. Use the force. Oh, they took the the nye, 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 massage chairs out. <laughs> like I couldn't think of what it was called. Nye, 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 nye. I don't mind staying here. Again. Yeah, Chewy just told me while we were waiting for the bus. This is his favorite. Let's stop at the front desk and ask a question. And as always, it's so beautiful here. So so beautiful. And. For those who did not see previous vlogs for Disney, the different coloration in the rocks is for the different deposit, you know, the different makeup compound. I don't know the right word there of the um, of the earth. You know, like how you can see the different sediment in a cross section of the Grand Canyon. Yeah, it's similar to that. I know there's a word for that, and I can't think of it. All right, Papi Chulo. This is the beginning of the water for the swimming pool, or at least the effect of it. So this bubbles up and carries outside, becomes a stream, and then becomes the pool. I can't smell what's going on too well with the masks on, but I, I get little whiffs of food. Territory Lounge. Artist Point. Sadly, I wanted to bring, not sadly, let me start over. Yeah, oh it is. New carpet, good, no, good for noticing. I wanted to bring Chewy here to do the Snow White meal that I did with Sean Vlog, Caroline and Sean. Um, but they're not doing it, obviously, during COVID, so another time. And there's where the water came out from the bubbling creek. The kid pool. The quiet pool is over by the Boulder Ridge section, which is behind this building. It comes down. It comes out over here, and then boom, into the pool. Yeah, we'll stay here next time. We really like it over here. I like their root beer here. Oh, that's right. I forgot it's a smoothie and you love smoothies. And there it is. Very smooth. Very smoothie. And I love this root beer. This guy? Yeah, I really like it. Because it's got cane sugar. 
it's not yeah. like processed sugar. I don't know. It just tastes really, really good. Laugh all you want. I'm a believer. Uh, there was going to be an hour wait to sit in one of the comfy chairs. There's the queue over there. So we opted to sit at the bar. So here we are. But yeah, these uh, these chairs are really comfortable. And then there's Bay Lake behind us. And our, our resort is just out through that dark space back there. So you like your smoothie? It's really good. Excellent. We're gonna chillax a little and sit here. Chewie's on his phone, not sure what he's doing. I don't care. We're just enjoying being outside. It was a beautiful day. Sprinkled on us a, just, a, just a tiny bit at Disney Springs. Oh, do you want to... Where's the camera bag? Oh, okay. The contemporary. That's as much as it cost us to get to Disney um, Epcot. And it's like we can we can literally see it, but there's no boats running. So if we want to go right behind us, we need to take a bus back to Disney Springs and transfer to the Contemporary. And I'm like, because that we waited what 20, 20 or 25 minutes for the bus, maybe 20 at Disney Springs. Yeah. But it's nice, you know. As soon as we walked in, I'm like, yeah. I really like it here. It's been a good day. Yeah, Tomorrow yeah. is oh. our chance to get a boarding group for Rise of the Resistance. We're going to studios tomorrow. Let's hope. And we're going to Oga's. Okay, this is about, I don't know, five, seven years ago, Coach was selling the series, I think, was just, I don't know if it was 10 or if it was X. I'm not sure how it was pronounced, but there was a series of Disney wallets and purses and backpacks, and I had been looking for a new wallet. The one I had been using for years was from 20, 2013, I Sometimes think, so long. when Chewie's mom was here, we bought matching wallets, Chewie's mom and I. It was 40 bucks, I loved it, but... The problem is it doesn't hold up over time with wear and tear. And, and I was looking to change it up a little. Anyway, let's go right back to the Coach X or 10, whatever, I don't know what it was. So I went into the Coach store on Madison Avenue on 57th Street and they said, we don't have any here, but you can order it and it'll come and we'll call you. And I was kind of like, oh, that's a lot. But to me, a wallet, it, it's important how the compartments are. And I was like, no. And then when we were here like maybe two or three years ago, we stopped in the Coach store at Disney Springs and they happened to have one. They were a different, uh, they were black with a very cropped section of Mickey's face. And it was one that I liked. He was kind of from the side, he had his nose. But, you know, it, it was a little more than I wanted to spend. And I, to be honest, the, the, the kicker was I would have paid anything if all the compartments were perfect for, for what I like to do with my wallet. But they weren't. So I was like, I passed. But I keep thinking about it and I keep thinking about it. And we stopped in again tonight. Do you have them? She goes, well, we don't really have that anymore. We have a new style. Here it is, and I'm in love because this is actually a perfect size. Look how adorable this is. And it's less 
than half the price of the other one. And I think it works better in here, right? Yeah, don't you agree? But it's really cute. Oh, there's all sorts of papers, but it opens up. You can put your, your cash in here and some credit cards. I can tell you now the little change purse part might be a little too small. But then again, who carries cash anymore? I think cash is going to be dead soon because of COVID. So yeah, thank you, Papa Chulo. You're welcome, Mama Chula. You know, I'm Camp Mickey. Look, Minnie, Minnie is fabulous, and I love Minnie, but I'm just not into getting things with Minnie on them. Mickey on them. And me. And, and Chewy. Well, if your picture was on here, I would buy it. No. Come on. Who are no, you no, no, no. Right? No. Well, thank you, Poppy. Anything, anything for you. Unwrap that when we get back to the room, so nothing spills on it. I can start carrying all my stuff in it tomorrow. We have to make sure when we get back to the room tonight, we know what to do. I know to sign in early at like quarter till seven, and then be in the little area at like five to seven, and then start refresh, refresh, refresh as soon as it hits seven o'clock. So. Wish us luck. Well, the only thing I can say is she's a very good trooper because for two days we've been walking almost five miles a day and she and she's been pretty tough and handled it pretty well. Well you know what? Props to my doctor because even though he was doing injections in my back to help with what happened was I fell on the ice and where the sciatic joint is on my lower right side where the tendon the muscle becomes the tendon and attaches to the, the pelvic bone it it got really messed up in the fall and yeah he would inject me with anti-inflammatories because I literally would try to get into the bathtub some nights to take a shower and I would cry. I mean, I was in so much pain for like five years. And after losing the 95 pounds, it's gotten better. But I'm gonna be really honest with you. I didn't, I wanted to pray and hope that I could do this trip without the ECB. And I'm, my feet are killing me because I'm so not used to walking this much. But I'm really so pleased with myself that I did it. And I'm doing it. And vlogging is more fun. Yeah, I could do it from the ECV, but I didn't feel connected to Chewy. And so it's really great doing this trip for the channel and feeling more and more like a unit, right? Yeah, we are. It's just so smooth. Good. <laughs> so yeah, I'm proud of myself for the progress. But is there a heat lamp? Oh, yeah, there. are. Why is my face so weird? Yeah. They're right there. So between the work, I'm, I'm out of shape. I need to start toning. So. Um, I'm gonna work on that. You will. Yeah. And I'm gonna be working hard. <laughs> so we're gonna sit and just enjoy each other's company and we'll check back when the food comes. Sean and Caroline, we have in the cheesy cheese. brisket. And had it not been for Sean, I would not have known about this because we tend to have our favorites on the menu and then we go to it. And I don't know, this never made my radar. You know, I think we always just went straight to the entrees. Let me see what you think of it. I thought it was good. It is. Oh, and it smells divine. Mm -hmm. I don't know how, oh, I forgot that it was in so much tomato -y sauce though. 
between you. Even a little bit, not much. Okay. There it is. What is something else? And there it is. We opted to get a crab cake also. And some fries. Are the fries hot? Yeah. Awesome. Look at the little animal tracks. <laughs> I love this detail at Wilderness Lodge. It's a really cool detail. Right at the entrance. All right. We have to call an Uber or a Lyft. A Lyft is 869. I don't care which one you pick. Whispering Canyon. We stayed up there once and I liked it because when we went to bed, you could hear the music until midnight and then it clicked off. But that was a cool, cool thing. New material on the couches. Goodbye, Wilderness Lodge. I love the lamps here. All around Wilderness Lodge. If I adjust the light normal, then you can't see it as much. But you, there, you can, oh, a little too dark. I mean, too light. There, now you can see the texture. Pretty, huh?